Yesterday, Kamala Harris went on one of the most popular podcasts in the country, Call Her Daddy, which I also like to call the 304 Podcast. And this whole thing is completely backfiring on her in the most hilarious way possible. She really thought that this was going to be a major W for her, but this has only resulted in a major backlash against her and Call Her Daddy Podcast, where everyone is completely destroying them for this entire thing. As you, as you can see here on the video for this that they posted yesterday, Vice President Kamala Harris, which was uh, from their podcast interview, th this video is getting completely destroyed on YouTube with 29,000 downvotes to 8,000 likes, okay? Everyone is completely destroying this video and it is hilarious stuff. So Caller Daddy host Alex Cooper ripped by fans over disgusting Kamala Harris interview, trying to make her look Gen Z, I'll never listen again. And they, she is getting completely flamed in these comments, okay? We're going to be taking a look at some of these comments in a little bit, but here are some of them and she is is getting completely obliterated absolutely destroyed it is not looking good for her at all regular listeners of the podcast known for its frank discussions about a range of subjects from human sexuality to advice for women are accusing her of simply regurgitating propaganda for the 2024 democratic party nominee which is exactly what this podcast was all about do you guys want to listen to just a little bit of it here you go we're going to go ahead and check out part of this and even in this intro for the video here it is absolutely horrific stuff so let's go ahead and check this out yeah mm -hmm. former president trump recently told women you will be protected and i will be your protector what do you make of that so this is the same guy that is now saying that this is the same guy who said that women should be punished for having abortions this is the same guy who uses the kind of language he does to describe women so, yeah, there you go. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, there, there you go. Uh, uh, my, my brain's malfunctioning. What do I do? Where's my teleprompter? <laughs> so this is all uh, completely backfiring on her. It is not looking good for her whatsoever. And like I said, she's getting completely roasted in the comments here. Look, guys, my father was a Marxist professor who abandoned me. The comments did not disappoint. Can't believe how tone deaf this interview is. I feel dumber after watching this. I am now burdened by what I have watched. <laughs> Came here for the comments. Did not disappoint. Unburdened by what has been. I lost brain cells watching this. The cringe and lip service is off the charts. It is absolutely falling apart on her, and it is glorious to watch, okay? There are so many comments that are completely destroying her. Selective service is required for all men to sign up. Millions of American men have died forcibly at the hands of government, which, of course, is one of the things that they talked about. They're like, can you think of anything where the government infringes on the rights of men, the bodily autonomy of men? And then, of course, everyone in the comments is completely destroying them but at the same time while well, we can laugh at all the stupidity of this because it is completely ridiculous and the, the podcast itself is utterly cringe okay but we have to get a little bit somber here because while it is also hilarious while it is entertaining to watch this completely fall apart on Kamala Harris we have to acknowledge the fact of the situation as Americans drown Kamala chats on a brain dead sex podcast and that right there completely summarizes this entire thing while the the hurricane has left nothing but a wake of devastation in the southern states we have seen Kamala taking fake pictures in an airplane with a blank piece of paper and you want these people to be in charge it's very obvious that it is all fake coming from these people that they don't actually care about the american people so this whole thing is absolutely insane but let me know what you think about all of this in the comments below let me know what you think about this hilarious backfire that kamala harris is facing now for being on this podcast hope you guys enjoyed leave a like subscribe and i'll talk to you all in another video very soon